Sir, if you come with me, we'll start the interview. Hey, babe, I'm sorry, man. I heard a new boss right here talk a whole lot of shit. Hope you paid good. Let's see how the shit go. Let's go. Hey, how you doing there, Leroy? All right, and yourself? All right. Well, first of all, we appreciate you applying for this job. You got a real nice resume. Uh, everything looks good over here, but you know we do research social media nowadays, and we happen to see that you double as a rapper. And in this particular video, you got on a wedding dress, and you deep throating a rifle. Well, my fans wanted something from me, and then I like to sit back and appeal to my artistic side of my music. It was not to be portrayed as me deep throating a rifle. That's just how it came out, and I just ran with it. Oh my goodness. Married to the game. Taking a rifle to the mouth. You know, the normal person doesn't do this. And we are a warehouse, but not only that, we deal with the public. So we have to be aware of who we bring in and their image, you know? So we took the liberty of looking over your lineage and your history to find out what would make somebody do something like that. And we notice here that your great, 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 great grandfather was raped several times by the slave master. Tell my Rufus. Yeah, back then they call it buck busting. And we thought maybe that was just something they did to take advantage of the slaves and nothing would be of that. But further on down, it shows you have two uncles that were given awards as the best dick suckers in the South. They were just punks. You can't sit back and like get no further away from it. They can't sit back and shy away from it. That's just what they did. What my uncles did, what my great grandfather did, that was on them. My great grandfather, he ain't had no choice, but my uncles, that's a whole different ball game. Well, with you putting on a wedding dress and taking a rifle to the mouth, talking about you married to the game, we we need more we need more circumstantial evidence to show that this is not a trait that carries on. Is is there anyone it's not a trait? It was a one time thing. They paid me lovely. Who who paid you? I can't tell you who paid me. What they give you? A little bit of this and a little bit of that. Is there anybody else that can speak for your character? Yeah. I got an uncle. Not one of them uncles. I got another uncle. Uh-huh. Big John. Big John. Let me call Big John. You got an uncle named Big John? Big John. Is that the people who slept with the prostitutes? I can't say. Or I can't say. That he did or he did not sleep with prostitutes, Big John. Hey, man. Big John, hey. what's going on, Big John? Hey, well, listen, no, I ain't know what's going on with me. What's going on with you? Hey, man, listen, no, I ain't know what's going on with you. Yeah. Hey, man, what's going on with you, man? I'm trying to get a reference from you. I need you to sit back at the corner with I understand that, but at the same time, man, I can't really give a reference if you're doing some things I don't agree with, man. Hey, man, listen, no, I ain't know what's going on with me. Yes, sir. How, how you doing today, sir? Hey, how you doing? How you doing? All right, my name is Mr. Wallace here, and we run this warehouse, and we deal with the public. And like I was explaining to Leroy here, that his resume is impeccable, but we also do a social media search. And yes. we found that he doubles as a rapper, and the footage that we have, he's wearing a wedding dress and deep-throating a rifle. I can say that. Are you able to um, get this? He, 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 he is okay as a regular person and everything else, but I don't know what made him um, get to that level to uh, uh, put a dress. I don't know if he was trying to make a, a point or uh, appearance or trying to do something. I, I don't know what was going on. Have you, have you ever seen him suck a dick? Um, I saw one time... Um, one time I was in the hotel, because uh, uh, we, we've been cool with this for a while. One time I was in the hotel, and um, uh, he, he, had, he got up from somewhere. I don't know if that was, I, I, I don't know what he was doing at that point. Um, maybe he was picking up something, something like that, uh, but I don't, I, I, I don't know. Okay. 
Uh, so, so would you say that this is just social behavior for him to get views and to get likes and this is not who he is today? Because like I told him, we did research and found that his great, 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 great grandfathers, they were raped by the slave master uh, back when they were doing buck busting. And uh, but later on, we know, you know, we thought that was just slaves couldn't help it. But then later on down the, down the line, he had two uncles that won awards for sucking dick. Can I, can, I, can, can, I, can I ask you a question? Yes. Have you ever been portrayed of sucking uh, dick? No, 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 not me personally. You know, I'm a I'm a businessman, well-established businessman. And uh, for you to be, let, let me tell you something. Like I said, he's a good worker. Uh, if he sucked dick, he sucked dick. But um, what? Have a Wait a minute. Are you are, 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 are you admitting? Are you are you saying that he did or? Did, I, I don't know, but I just know that your pencil isn't sharpened. Um, I don't know if you saw dick or not, but I, 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 it's a possibility. You, you see, there's there's a tip on that. He, I didn't want him to deep throat this, so that I didn't I didn't want it real long. Because if you saw the video, he took the rifle halfway down his throat. I mean, that since he's since, since he's been in the interview with you, sir. And I, and I want to be uh, respectful with you, uh, and I, I, I think you should hire him. But since he's been in the interview with you, uh, have uh, has he uh, tried in any way to uh, suck uh, your dick? No, 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 sir, no, sir, no, sir. I, 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 I would I allow him to? Correct. No, I, I wouldn't even entertain the thought. I mean, it, it's. Well, wait a minute, uh, Mr. What's your uncle's name? Uh, I'm just asking a question. Do, do you like your dick suck? I don't. You got a wife? I mean, if. Yes, but, okay, well, yeah. have, have her ask me that question because it, it doesn't feel good coming from you, but uh, if you have a wife or something or a daughter, uh, I will answer to them. I never had a man ask me if I like my dick suck before. It kind of feels weird. Well, don't, hey, 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 you don't have to tell me about that. There's there's people out there that can accommodate you. I'm just saying, I'm, I'm just saying it's, a, it's it, 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 like, sometimes, you know, it, this is how the world works and everything goes. It's, it's a give and take. So, like, you know, um, maybe he can possibly, he's a good, he's a good worker. Maybe he can possibly, you know, suck a dick. All right, we're going to end this, we're going to end this interview. This has went a bit too far, um... You maybe you dialed the wrong person. I don't know, but uh, we ain't hiring you. You, you, you asked, you got the video. You got an uncle asking me to let you suck my dick. I'm sorry. Well, look, I ain't want this motherfucking funky ass out no way. Quit. <laughs>